Yo, did you hear about Varda Space Industries' latest shit? They launched their third orbital processing and re-entry capsule, W3. That's some space economy hustle. Yes, W3 launched on SpaceX's Transporter 13. It's carrying a badass inertial measurement unit from the U.S. Air Force and Innovative Scientific Solutions Incorporated. They're testing it at re-entry speeds of over Mach 25. Ever seen a device face its ultimate test, like literally coming back down to Earth? Hell no, but that sounds fucking intense. So they're pushing this thing to see if it can handle the heat? Precisely. It's never been tested at those speeds before. It's about gathering data for high hypersonic technologies. Imagine your phone being thrown from space and still working. Man, that's wild. And Varda's trying to do this monthly? That's some next level space factory shit. Indeed, they aim for a monthly launch and re-entry cadence. Making space-based manufacturing and research as routine as ordering pizza. Who knew space could be so accessible? Accessible as fuck. So this capsule re-enters at over Mach 25 and they're just going to keep doing this? That's some hardcore science right there. Absolute. It's a unique environment for researchers to gather data. And it's not just about the speed. It's about making space tech a part of our daily lives. Are you ready for space to become as mundane as your morning coffee? Shit, if my morning coffee could re-enter at Mach 25, I'd be hype as hell. <laughs> Thanks for breaking it down, Prof. So, are we all going to be space nerds soon? With Varda's plans, we might just be. Follow if you want to know more about the future of space manufacturing and as always thanks for watching